Have you ever felt so sick in your life where you eat things just because your body really needs those things? Well, that's what I've come to. Got some stuff and I'm gonna put them together in a pot and let's see if it tastes good. So, first of all, some nice beef cubes. Then uh, mix, mix vegetables and uh, green beans, bananas and onions, my anti-corona beer. Then that is fresh olive oil that got squeezed right from the teat of the olive tree. Then for spices I've got lots of oregano. Uh, pepper, salt, caraba uh, uh seeds, um, hot paprika, ground cumin and a tiny little bit of cinnamon. Yeah. So let's see how it goes. And with that I think I'm gonna have uh, rice. Yeah. First we fry the meat. Just to get the Maillard reaction going. And basically that's proteins and sugars combining to create brand new molecules of flavor. Yeah, and uh, the reason why I've only got like frozen stuff, um, I, I can't really chop anything. So, yeah. I have now added the onion. And uh, yeah, the reason why I'm using a banana is to get some sweetness into there and also for the consistency of the sauce. So I uh, was gonna put carrots, but there, there wasn't any grated carrots and uh, with me not being able to chop them, Bananas seem like a good alternative. Rest of the ingredients in. There's a couple of cans of crushed tomatoes. And now I'm gonna add the beer. Oil is slowly separating itself from the, I don't know, gravy. I'm gonna take the lid off and maybe reduce it by, I don't know, a liter. So, so I don't know, an hour or so, and then I can put on the rice, and there we go. I am truly impressed. I think eating this now will be the highlight of my two and a half weeks, my broken arm, and look at that. I've uh, added uh, tzatziki, strawboard and pear jam, also strawboard and all together this whole meal costs 10 euros but you have to know there is still so much more in the kitchen so I think uh, it will feed myself for four days so I'm gonna freeze it and it's it's so great. Tzatziki was an absolute must um, due to the large amount of uh, hot paprika I used but the pear jam I'll give that a miss next time but the the whole thing was awesome. So Banana goulash, done!